16 years ago on this day, we concluded the 90-day wholeness program in this place on 13 September, I think. So, uh, when I suddenly remembered this in the afternoon, I was itching to do something. So, when we were doing the wholeness program with those uh, sixty and odd people, very hardy ones because there was no place to live, a hut was that was threatening to fall down any time, repeatedly threatening us that it's going to come down upon us. But still, we did all that we had to do there. And uh, at that time, everybody dreamt we must build a meditation hall. It took uh, maybe another six years or seven years before we built the Spanda Hall. Today, it is such that the Spanda Hall is occupied almost twenty, twenty to twenty-five days in a month and it's not available for anybody in the ashram. And uh, Sadhana Hall is anyway bursting at the seams. So, uh, today we started a project called Adi Yogi Alayam, a south facing, a meditation hall which is south facing because Adi Yogi, when he ta sat as a Guru, he sat south facing. So this meditation hall is south facing and uh, we will have a wonderful consecration which will befit him for this hall. And the hall is uh, a little over forty thousand square feet. So and plus there's an extension that we can open up and up to twelve thousand people can sit <coughs> in the whole area. About six thousand people will have roof, another six thousand people will have to sit like you're sitting right now. So, uh, we came up with a design today afternoon and uh, I thought the boys are tired after the temple and the school construction, you know, a very big school building is coming up out there. Nobody has seen, we will open on twenty-third, you can be there on that day. So I thought they're little exhausted and will go a little slow and I asked them how many months? They said, we'll do it in three months. That's a phenomenal challenge. <laughs> to build this building which is over forty thousand square feet and to do it in ninety days. We have a fetish with the ninety days, you know. Uh, so probably sometime September, come September next year, Uh, or maybe for the sake of the weather we may push it to October or November where we'll uh, have a big program in the Adi Yogyalayam which will be probably a series of programs for those two months, let's see how but definitely we will be doing uh, a program called Mahabharat. Uh, what? Saga Unparallel. <laughs> we are not going to do the whole Mahabharat. We are just going to pick one, twelve to fifteen themes in Mahabharat and handle the story supported by various artists in terms of dance and other kinds of depictions. 
we want to make this program into a, a mega happening in the ashram. Not just a program that happens inside a hall where we sit and talk and do meditations, this, that. This is a happening, this is an event. We want this to be a real mega event, a biggest, uh, the grandest depiction of Mahabharata that could have happened anywhere, we want to make it like that.